दिस इज द क्वेश्चन ऑफ 2010 अक्टूबर नवंबर पेपर 11 एंड द क्वेश्चन नंबर इज 37 इट सेज दैट इन दिस सर्किट पी इज अ पोटेंशियल मीटर ऑफ टोटल रेजिस्टेंस 10 ओम क्यू इज द फिक्स्ड रेजिस्टर ऑफ रेजिस्टेंस 10 ओम द बैटरी हैज ईएमएफ ऑफ 4 वोल्ट एंड इट हैज गॉट अ नेग्लिजिबल इंटरनल रेजिस्टेंस and the voltmeter here has got very high resistance which is uh, the requirement of every voltmeter so when you move the slider slider from x to y from x to y and we plot a graph of voltmeter reading reading here uh, versus the slider position it's it ask us uh, which graph would be obtained so before dealing with this uh, we can break this uh, circuit as this so we can modify the circuit as so this is the source here this is the source and from here i can design the circuit as this i can break the potentiometer into two parts so one of the part is py and another uh, another part is px so here this is resistance q this is portion y and this is portion p and then from here starts another part here this is p and this is x and from here starts the voltmeter v so we have a broken we have broken this uh, uh, potentiometer into two parts one is py from here to here and another is px from here to here so this is the point p here point p uh, i can uh, i can assume that i can extend p from here to here and here to here so this uh, uh, the emf here is 4 volt by the properties of voltage what we have is from here to here from here the voltage in between these two points is also 4 volt so i can write here v p q is also equal to 4 volt now if i use the, the potential divider formula so uh, e or v p q is equal to 4 volt so the reading given by the voltmeter will be v as recorded by the voltmeter will be equal to r of v divided R V, uh, then uh, plus R P X into E. R V is very high, which means it is almost infinite. So it's also infinite. So compared to the voltages here, resistors, uh, resistances here, the resistance of R P X will be almost zero, almost zero um, compared to the resistance of R V. So we, I can assume that. R P X is nearly equal to zero, so this gives me V vertical equal to R V by R V plus zero into E equal to R V by R V into E equal to E. So whatever be the position of the slider, uh, V V recorded by the voltmeter will be equal to E, which is four volt. so the graph should be uh, choice number a because it says that uh, the value of v is constant at 4 volts